go, 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 Hi guys, welcome back. Thank you so much for tuning in to my last video. I appreciate you all so much. I looked at all the comments. Thank you for all the love. My birthday was on Sunday. I had to go to church to give praise to the Lord for giving me a new year, new grace, new mercy. And of course, I felt like the sermon was talking to me. On my way home, I get a call from my hubby and he says, um, are you almost home? I said, yes. He says, put on your camera as you enter the gate. I'm thinking, what is this now? But before I tell you that, I have the biggest, biggest car fantasies ever. I'm a vintage girl. I love a vintage car. My dream is to drive in one of those old school cars with my glasses on and my scarf. And I'm like, you know, going down the speedway. You know what I mean? Ladies, I know how you feel about vintage cars. Like, that's a thing for me. I'll show you. I'll show you a little something. This, this. This is my ideal car. I almost kind of picture a car like this. So I'm driving into my driveway. As I'm driving into my driveway, what do I see? Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. Like, I almost fell to the ground. I was in so much shock. Like, so now I'm back in now. Time to get ready for my party. Of course, makeup has to get done. Makeup done. I'm thinking of my outfit. I didn't know what I was going to wear, but my theme was Arabian Bollywood. So I just knew I wanted to stand out. So, hair, of course, I changed my hair look. Same <laughs> from the all back. I switched it up a little bit. Now I changed my outfit and I'm thinking Arabian Bollywood. I had this fabric. I didn't know what I was going to wear last minute, guys. I literally had the fabric I remembered was in my office. Drove there, got the fabric and literally wrapped it around me. <laughs> but it ended up looking awesome. It stood out. It looked like something off the runway. <laughs> you know how I like to do. Got my glasses on as usual. And then it was off to take pictures by my famous doorstep. My guests started arriving. My girls. And everyone went with the theme. You see them with the whole Bollywood stuff going on on their face. I was like, oh my God. They went with the whole theme. And then when they got in, they actually thought the car was a prop. Until they were like, so what did you get for your birthday? I was like, um, that car over there. They said, no, that's a prop. You mean that car moves? I was like, I know, it moves. My party had to be in my back garden. So we went to my back garden, sat down. I had fans prepared for every single one, feathered fans. And then we had the henna lady who came and like gave you henna. I didn't get to do any myself because obviously there wasn't no time for that. We set up such a nice lunch, that stroke dinner. Chef Eros was amazing. The food was awesome. And then we went into karaoke. <laughs> I'm not really a fan for karaoke, but my girlfriend, Idera, she had been asking for a karaoke for over a year. Every day, can we go do karaoke? So I thought it was only right to have that at my party as a surprise for them.
my cake guys obviously to go with my theme i had to get the whole arabian bollywood going i had the pillow cushions on the cake tower after tower after tower fruit cake the other one was strawberry and vanilla and then it had a little pot it was so cute and then we hit the club guys i know what you're thinking i drove that car to the club people were staring like what is this are you all right but it drove smoothly i felt like i was in an old school movie listening to destiny's child <laughs> Thank you for tuning in to watch me today. I want you to realize that the power that you have is greater than what's in your mind. Whatever you can think can become your reality. Don't sleep on yourself. Don't let anybody sleep on you. Get up, move. Even if you had so many no's and so doors closed behind you, every single thing that you need to get to the next level is already in you. You just need to realize that you have it. I believe in you and I know that you can become the best and greatest version of yourself. So for your comments, you can drop your comments. I promise I will read them and I will answer them. Also, tell me what is your favorite birthday present that you have ever gotten? Because by far, I promise you, this is mine. And I've had some really good presents and surprises, but this is mine. Tell me yours. Follow me on my Instagram at lovefromjewels. Join and subscribe this page, Modern African Woman. Thank you so much for joining me.